Okay, Advent guitar is a day eight, so I'm talking about string bending today. And the two most important things in order when you bend a string. One, know which note you're trying to bend to. Number two, reach that note. Sounds really simple, but so many people sort of don't quite make it or bend too far or something. So here's how you can practice pitching your bends correctly. So I'm going to pick a note that I'm going to bend to, so sticking with the A pentatonic minor. Right, let's bend to this note. So the root note, the high A. I'm going to practice bending from one fret below, so play the, the note and then retain the sound of that pitch in your mind. And see if you can bend from one fret below, then see if you can bend from two frets below. Notice that I'm holding it. When you get there, hold it at pitch. That will develop the strength and the uh, sort of reinforce the muscle memory a bit. Then maybe try from three frets below if you've got the right string gauge. You know that sort of thing. Then and only then try adding vibrato and so on. So you know where you're bending. You know what you're bending to. Every interval, you know, two frets, three frets, whatever, um, will require very, very slightly different movements uh, in terms of where you are on the fingerboard as well. You know, if I'm, say, up here on the E string, the amount of force required to bend a tone is very different to the amount of force required to bend a tone down here. You know, so you get used to that with a bit of time on the instrument, but it's worth doing because an out of tune bend is a bad sound. So practice that, have fun with it, see you tomorrow.